everybody, welcome to the 2024 New York International Auto Show. Uh, I am here with Anthony and we are going to talk about this amazing Jaguar that is behind us. So Anthony, why don't you just give us a little bit of a background about the car, how it got here and what makes it so special? Sure, so the car that we're standing in front of right now is the 1993 Jaguar XJ220N. It is a race car that was produced after um, Jaguar pulled 12 cars off the Jaguar XJ220 production line. With those 12 cars, they built a few specialized variants of the Jaguar XJ220. This is a aluminum body Jaguar XJ220N. It is a road legal car with a full Jaguar VIN number. This car that we're standing in front of was used as a backup car for the 1993 Italian GT Championship. But going all the way back into the history of the Jaguar XJ220, it's definitely important to also talk about how the XJ220 came to be. The 12 Jaguar engineers, an informal group of Jaguar engineers known as the Saturday Club, got together and they came up with the idea for the Jaguar XJ220. Jaguar's director of engineering at the time, his name was Jim Randall. Jim Randall is the one that laid the groundwork for the XJ220 project and a South African designer by the name of Keith Helfit is the one that came up with the exterior styling for the XJ220. Now, the car was debuted at the 1988 Birmingham Motor Show, and during that time, Jaguar had a lot of interesting plans for the XJ220, which included a 12-cylinder engine, scissor-style doors that you would normally see on a Diablo or a Countach, and all of those things that were promised were unfortunately not followed through with. So the production XJ220, ended up with a six cylinder engine, traditional uh, style doors, and all of the things that they said they were gonna do, they didn't really do. So as a result of that, all of the deposits made for the XJ220 at the time, a lot of them had dropped out, meaning that just 280 total XJ220s were built in the end, around that number. Um, so of the 280, like we said, 12 of those cars were pulled from the production line to become specialized variants, with this one being the Jaguar XJ220N. Now, as we said, the XJ220N was a race car. This one was unraced. So this was a backup car for the 1993 Italian GT Championship, where three cars were used, but only cars 11 and number 12 were raced. This one as a backup. So it has no livery. As you can see, it's finished in its original spa silver paint finish. And it's definitely an interesting piece of history and something that's definitely special here at the New York Auto Show. And on behalf of the Caretakers Collection, who has an incredible collection of cars, located in California. This is just one of their amazing pieces of machinery that they have.